Capricorn, come on in, put your feet up, make yourselves at home. My name is Jen Dawson, welcome to Gen TV. All right, Capricorn, I've been meditating on it. And it just kept coming around to this song for you, Without You, by Badfinger. Um, if other people have covered it, but let's, you know, Badfinger rock. Not a very sad story about the band, but uh, it's a beautiful song. Without You. You know, no, I can't forget this evening, nor your face as you're leaving. Well, I guess that's just the way the story goes. You always smile with your eyes, your soul shows. I know, I'm a terrible singer. And the more it kind of went on, coming through my head, I, I kind of... I see the story. It's like, wow. I'm not going to cry. It's like, uh, I see you, you're kind of letting them go. And you're trying to be okay about it, but you're not. And you can't really hide. They see it. You can't really hide the pain, they see it. It's over and you're trying to be okay. But you're sort of wondering, am I gonna be okay without this person? without you. Bear in mind my loves, these are general readings so it's not going to resonate with all of you but if it does take a look in the description box below there's a link to my Patreon if you want to watch extended videos. I'm not doing private readings at this time. What you feel right now I, mean, I just want to get straight to that point. This is what you need to know right now, my love. What you feel right now, it's temporary, okay? You're not going to hurt like this forever. So the uh, overall energy here is the Ace of Cups. That's, that's your one true love, you know? This is your one true love. That's how you feel right now. This is what's going on right now, though. This is what you're feeling. The devil. It's a very... Things just, you know, got unhealthy. I feel like there, there was a lot of... I'm trying to think of the word here. It's it's like a attachment to each other. Very there's a lot of anxious attachment to each other, both of you. A lot of anxiety in the attachment. Where are you? Who are you with? You put your shoes on for me this morning and I felt <laughs> I felt all unnecessary. You didn't kiss me the way you usually do. What you feel right now, it's it's not gonna go on forever. It you, you feel like you can't live without this person. I can't live if living without you. Can't say the word. Bad little. Can't live anymore. Why is the sun in reverse here? This is um what you don't know. It's temporary. It's time to walk away from it. It's time time to the thing that you know 
the thing that you guys didn't really put out there when you were in a relationship together was boundaries. There was a lot of anxious energy between you, anxious attachment. You didn't sort of set your boundaries and you didn't stick to them. If, if they set theirs, you didn't stick to their boundaries. I can just see that this was a very painful relationship. A lot of yearning, pining, ah, kind of like, God, can't live without you. But look, you can't live with each other either. And it got too much and it ended. Okay. Why is the Nine of Pentacles here? This is what you should do now. Nine of Pentacles. This this one's in charge, mate. This one's very secure, very stable, very in their own power. They don't need somebody to be happy. This is what you should do. The outcome. Nine of Wands this is about setting boundaries, meaning them, not getting into another relationship where there's a lot of ooh, like intense anxiety around each other tell me more about this nine of pentacles what you should do You shouldn't jump into another relationship, that's for sure. I sort of feel like there's connections around you that feel kind of safe and comfortable. And I would say that keep those connections as they are for now. Don't sort of uh, confuse them for love and, and relationship when I think it's it's safer to keep people in your life where they are just for now until you are fully in your nine of pentacles and you can get into a relationship without these intense anxiety attachment Let's ask about this nine of wands and the outcome. Why is this nine of wands for the outcome? This is about setting your boundaries and meaning them and understanding that you've been hurt in the past and, and where the pain comes from. So you can look out for it and, and know when to deal with it. So you can hear my washing machine going berserk. When you come to an understanding within yourself about what I just said, where the pain comes from, where the attachment and the anxiety comes from. When you can understand that more within yourself, you can start manifesting in your Nine of Cups, your wish fulfillment. What, what are you looking for in the future? Where do you want to be in the future? Who do you want to be with? You know, you can start manifesting that in and then you know going for it having a ball but you gotta you've got to step into your power in the nine of pentacles you have to you see those nines are very important to me like they're they you have to stabilize yourself and the only way you can stabilize yourself is by understanding the patterns in your life and what has caused you pain in the past so that you can eradicate it. I'm going to take it into the extent where I'm going to ask about this person. How do they really feel about you? Where are you in their heart space? What are their intentions towards you? What do they want to say to you? And some guidance from the universe. 
but you feel like you can't live without this person right now, it's temporary in my lips. Anything else? This too shall pass, yes. Again, like with the sun reversed, this it's, it's temporary. The pain that you feel, this too shall pass. This is temporary. See, because a new start is coming. Okay. Your song of the day, obviously, is Without You by Badfinger. Nielsen did a beautiful cover of it, though. Nilsson. All right, there you go. You are moving in the right direction. So moving on, healing, literally everything I just said, that's good. So yeah, I've done your song of the day, Without You by, by um, Badfinger. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell. And if you want to watch the extended, take a look at the description box below. There is a link to my Patreon. You'll find the video there. See you later.